Anders Antonsen, Denmark off to a good start, 1-0 against France. How did you see the game on court today? I think it was a tough uh, two-set game. I think uh, Luca played a really good match and uh, made it made it really tough for me, especially in the first game. Um, yeah, but I'm uh, really satisfied with the way I handled this uh, this first match uh, for Denmark on home court, um, and I had to start things off. So I'm really happy to give the team a, a win. First time in ages, Denmark playing on home soil in, at a team event. Uh, how is it to be the first on court? Um, I mean, it's uh, it was nice. It was, uh, I was happy to uh, you know lead out, and um, yeah, hopefully we will see a little bit. Uh, I mean, uh, more people in the upcoming days, but uh, but it was still good to play here on on on, on, on home soil. <laughs> It's no secret that there's been a union uh, thing going on between the players and, and the federation. How is it to be now on the other side of that, now focusing on what's happening on court and not outside of court? It's of course really great. Um, it was a weird situation, but we're over it now. And uh, and yeah, I'm really happy to you know represent the country again uh, and practice at the national center. It's, uh, it's really good to be back. And finally, Anas, uh, Denmark is the favorite. You are the top seed in, in this tournament. How do you see the chances of, of claiming the title once again? Um, I think there's a lot of good teams uh, who can challenge us. And we are maybe struggling a little bit um, in a few categories. Not as strong as we usually were. Um, so it's going to be tough. And uh, I'm, I'm actually hoping that there will be some, some close team matches. That would, be, that would be fun. But hopefully we can pull out as uh, the winners once again. What categories are you struggling in, as you mentioned? Yeah. Ha <laughs> ha.